with another banger video, man. And today, as you guys can see by the title, man, Chosen Ones. Self-discipline will guarantee you success and self-love, you feel me? Before we start this video, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. A lot of you guys are watching the vids, but aren't subscribed. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It helps support the channel. Also, guys, I really do appreciate 5K subscribers, man. We're on the road to 10K. We grind it every single day, and we ain't stopping, you dig? Comment down below what you guys want to see next, and I got y'all, man. Y'all been showing me so much love, and I really do appreciate that. Now, before we start this video, guys, like I always state, take everything that I say with a grain of salt, you feel me? My perspective might change a day, two days, a year from now. Who knows? We're constantly growing, and if you're not growing, what are you doing? Also, guys, I love hearing the stories, the messages in the comment sections, guys. I respond to them all, and I love hearing it, man. You guys are such a big inspiration to me. You feel me? I love that you guys, you know, motivate me every single day, man, to keep pushing, to keep growing every single day. And if you guys got something to say that is too personal, let me know on Instagram. I do respond to that. It might be a little day, a couple days later, but I do respond. You feel me? And if you do not agree with what I'm saying, let me know in the comment section. I'm understanding. I'm understanding. You feel me? All right, now check me out, guys. Self-discipline is very important, man. Uh, this is this is another video where we're gonna hold ourselves accountable chosen ones you feel me a lot of you guys are trying to you trying to reach your dreams you you manifest in everything you working towards it but the whole thing the whole the main thing is that we got to have self-discipline you feel me self-discipline is key to having the success that you want out of life do you know what i'm saying the materialistic things and also you know what i'm saying the things that matter most which is self-love and and things that that bring you without without having the materialistic things. You feel me? So I'm, I'm going to tell you this right now, man. A lot of you guys, you feel me? I'm going to give you all some scenarios. You know, a lot, a lot of you guys want to start your own business, right? You've been working. You've been putting in that work. But you know, you know, sometimes you got your friends that will call you up and tell you, hey, man, come outside. You know what I'm saying? Self-discipline is when, 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 you, when you know that you should be working, you feel me? And you tell yourself, like, man, I know I... I want to go out there, but, you know, I, I can't because I need to put this work in into my business because I know if I take this little time off right now, then my business ain't going to do too well. Or, you know, you know, you want to take care of your body and you tell you, you're telling yourself because most of the time when you're talking to your you, self-discipline, you, you, you're you telling yourself this. You feel me? Nobody else. It's self-discipline. You, so you're talking to yourself. You feel me? I know I want this pizza, but I know it's going to make me feel bad. You feel me? And I know it's going to make my body feel like crap, so I'm not going to eat this pizza. You feel me? Or, uh, man, like, I want to go outside and go have a couple drinks, you know, get drunk tonight. But, like, dang, man, I'm, I can't do that because, you know, I got to wake up early in the morning and, and, and start my and get back to work. That's self-discipline. But it also comes down to it because you, now you're loving yourself because you don't want to put yourself in that predicament. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to make yourself feel bad. Eating that pizza, you know you're going to make yourself feel bad. So now you're loving yourself. You got that self-love. You feel me? Self-discipline will help you get to the goals and the, and, the, and the dreams that you've been manifesting. You feel me? Without self-discipline, you won't be able to make it, man. You'll be able to fall right back into that trap every single time. And I know it's tough, guys. I know self-discipline is, is, is tough. Reflecting on self is hard. It's very hard to reflect on self. You feel me? When you alone, when you with somebody else and you got somebody to help you do it, it, it becomes easier, you know? But it's, it's easier for you to mess up too. Self-discipline is those days that you don't want to get up and go do it, but you know, like, if I don't, if I don't go get it, it could be the day that I miss out. The days that you tired, for those of you guys that work out, I know you guys, you're like, dang, I don't feel like going to the gym today. But those are the days that you need to go. Those are the days that are like most valuable because it keeps you on track. It keeps you motivated. It keeps you moving. Once you get that momentum, guys, I'm telling you, once you get momentum, it's hard to stop it. But once you lose it, it's hard to get it back. You feel me? You take, you take, you go to the gym for, for a whole month and then you take three days off. It's hard to go back into that system that you was on. You go to the gym for a year, you know, you, you constantly going. You like, I can't miss a day. You know, you, you, you sick, you're not feeling too well, and you and you go in anyways. 
because it, and it makes it a lot easier because you've been going for a year. You like, dang, I can't miss a day. You know what I'm saying? I can't miss a day that I, I don't have scheduled. You feel me? But as soon as you take off a whole week, it's like getting back to that gym on that next Monday. It's like, bro, I don't even feel like it. I lost all momentum. I lost all courage. So now you might go for a couple days. But then after that, you like, bro, I don't even feel like going no more. Like, I'm going to take another day off. You feel me? Once you take that one day, once you take that that one cheat meal, it's like it, it turns into a cheat day. And then it turns into a cheat week. And then you off your diet completely. Do y'all get what I'm saying? Self-discipline keeps you in, in, in alignment. It keeps you in alignment. And then, and then, and then you also able to like protect, you know, yourself, your body, your mind, your soul. You feel me? Going out with these low vibrational people, you know what I'm saying? You know that you shouldn't be going out there. You're telling yourself, man, if I go out there and I go party with these people right now, how will I feel? Will I feel good? You're telling yourself, no, nah, I'm not going to feel good. So self-discipline is just correcting yourself, but also for yourself. You know what I'm saying? We, 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 we do it for the, for, we, we, we go out there for the materialistic. We Self-discipline can help you reach the materialistic things, but it'll also help you keep your mind, your body, and your soul in a, in a good vibration, high. Because now you're protecting yourself from these low vibrational people. In order for you to reach your dreams, in order for you to chase, I mean, in, in order for you to become an entrepreneur, you got to have self-discipline to, to know that I can't go out every single weekend. In order for you to become a millionaire, just know that you can't go out every single weekend and be spending money, buying shoes, buying clothes, things that you don't need. You on a mission. You on a, you on a grind right now. A lot of you guys are on a mission right now, man. If you're trying to get that million dollars, if you're trying to get that self-love, you got us question sometimes. Like, dang, bro, do I need to go? Do I should I go and hang around these people that I know ain't gonna be right for me? No? Okay, well, I'm not going. Do I need to go and buy these five hundred dollar pair of shoes when I know, you know what I'm saying, I could stack that five hundred dollars up and go and invest it? with something else and try to make that into a, you know, that $500 into like $2,000. And that $2,000 turn into $10,000. And that $10,000 turn into $50,000. So on and so on and so on. You feel me? That's what self-discipline is. Do I need the shoes or do I, can I, can I put that money towards something else that's gonna help me invest to get to where I wanna, where I wanna be? Do I eat this pizza? Nah, it's not gonna make me feel good. So now you're taking care of your body. There's, that's where the self-love come in. Do I, do I want this pizza? I don't want it. I don't need it. It's going to make me feel like crap. So if I eat it, then it's going to probably lead down to, you know what I'm saying, other effects that's going to make me feel even more worse. I'm going to start eating other food that's going to make me feel like trash. Do I need to be in this relationship? Do I need to, you know what I'm saying? Do I need this relationship? Nah, I don't need to be in this relationship, man. I'm going to take the time for myself and, and continue to be by myself for a while until I actually feel like I'm truly, you know what I'm saying, to a point to where I, you know what I'm saying, I'm not really healed right now. I'm still going through it. I still think about this every single day in my head. You feel me? I'm not really healed to the point to where I can give my all to somebody right now. So I'm going to take my time and I'm going to... That's self-love. That's, that's self-discipline. They come in cohesion. They, they work together. Now you know... When you when you got self discipline, you a bad mom, you bro, you bad. You feel me? Because people going people going continue to ask you to do things. You gonna have things that you want to buy. You know, we got all type of advertisement nowadays that make you that 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 encourage you to buy things. You feel me? And a lot of people don't have self discipline. Self discipline are those people that are one percenters of the world, man. You know, ninety nine percent of the people in this world cannot. You know what I'm saying? They don't have self-discipline. They don't have the discipline to get up every single day and do something before they go out and have fun with somebody. They don't have the discipline to go put 10 hours in into their business before, you know, they go out and go drink. They don't have the self-discipline to not put this certain foods in their body, knowing that it's going to make them feel bad and it's going to make them feel bloated. It's going to make them, you know what I'm saying? Probably take off years of their life. They don't have a self-discipline like you know, like that. But these people that are successful, when it comes down to materialistic things, you feel me? It's only 1%. 1% of 
but it's also it also leads down to self love too because if you taking if you taking that time not to put those toxic foods into your body if you taking the time to you know what I'm saying like not like I said not put the toxic foods in your body it's showing that you love yourself enough to not destroy your body by putting in these these toxic foods self discipline will lead you to success man it will help you get to where you want to be you know you young some of you guys are young right now a lot of you guys in my in my comment section y'all are young bro y'all still got so much time to live to to get to where y'all want to be to get to where y'all want to be do it now man so that way when you 35 40 years old 50 years old you ain't chasing nothing you already got it self-discipline now get it right now I don't know about y'all, but when y'all see certain people, when y'all, you know what I'm saying? They say the party life, you young, get it while you're doing, have your fun right now, bro. I don't believe, I I truly believe you had your fun in your 30s. You get what you needed during your 20s. You work your butt off during your 20s. You got the most energy. You got all this time. You get, you know what I'm saying? Get it right, right you can right now and enjoy it. So now you got yourself, you know what I'm saying? All that self-discipline that you had while you was young. Now you enjoying the moments while you, while you aging. You know what I'm saying? Your best moments is when you're really in your 30s, your 40s. And I don't know because I'm not I'm not that age, but you know, your 20s is cool and all, but bro, wouldn't you want to enjoy something when you got the money? You can't do everything when you when you steady, you gotta go to a nine to five, you know what I'm saying? You work your butt off for what 50 hours a week, then you go and spend it, and then you're doing the same thing and over and over again. Now your money ain't really making money for you. You feel me? You want to you want a source of income that's bringing in where you ain't got to put your time into it. You feel me? That's where that self-discipline is going to come in effect. I know I've been all over the video, you know what I'm saying, all over the place in this video, but listen, self-discipline will help you get that income to where you don't have to worry about spending 10 hours, you know what I'm saying, just to to get what I'm paying, you know what I'm saying? Cuz if if you got to put your services in for each business, that's taking your time. You can't actually enjoy it. But if I can go make, if I can make a couple businesses that's gonna bring me income and I don't gotta do nothing, I can just sit back and I can relax, go on vacation and it's still bringing me income. I'd rather be disciplined now, early on, than later on down the road, trying to chase it, trying to get it. When I ain't really got the energy, when it's, now my, my opportunities are a lot lower because, you know what I'm saying? Come on, man. I love y'all, bro. I know I was probably all over the place on this video, man, but just realize that self-discipline will lead you to success in the materialistic world. But also in the 5D, when we're talking about spirit, mentally, physically, and spiritual. You feel me? Knowing that you know you, you can't really go out there and have no drinks right now. You can't, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I gotta go do this meditation session real quick because if I don't do this, you know what I'm saying? My whole aura gonna be off for the rest of the day. My, my equilibrium gonna be off. So let me go ahead and do this meditation session real quick. Well, let me go ahead and put my 10 hours into this business so five years from now, I don't gotta worry, really worry about nothing. I can just, you know what I'm saying, sit back and let my business do its thing. Take care of your mind, your body, and your soul, bro. I love y'all, y'all are my family. Y'all are my family and I love hearing the stories, the messages, the love, the motivation. You feel me? Make sure y'all are trying to get out there in that sun, get that nature, you feel me? Drink some water. Plant y'all's foods if y'all can. If y'all can't, so be it. But make sure y'all eating right. I know I be slipping up sometimes. It is what it is. But I try to make sure I'm good. Most of the time. Go outside, get some nature. Go to the gym, exercise. Y'all been smashing that like button. And I really do appreciate that. Once again, guys, I really do appreciate 5K subscribers. We on the road to 10K. We grinding every single day. And we ain't stopping, you dig? I got the pranks. I got the vlogs. I got what you need. All you need to do... Subscribe to me. I'm out of here, man. Peace.